Hello! Welcome to the Grammar Master. This is a brief lesson about using commas with subordinate conjunctions. Before you can understand this comma rule, you need to understand independent and dependent clauses. Independent clauses are complete sentences. They have a verb, which can be a linking verb. The primary linking verbs are am, is, are, was, and were. Or an action word, like walks, talked, or sing. They also need a subject. The subject is the performer of that verb, which would be a noun or pronoun. For instance, the child ran home is an independent clause or a complete sentence. It has a verb, the action word ran, and a subject, child. The child ran. Dependent clauses are a little bit different. They're clauses, so they have a subject and a verb, just like independent clauses do. The difference is that they begin with a subordinate conjunction. And these are words like although, since, while, and before. The rule involving dependent clauses and independent clauses is that if you have the dependent clause first, then you need a comma between them. For example, since the dog was asleep, comma, the cat ate. Here I have two clauses. I have a dependent clause at the beginning, the subject dog and the verb was, with the subordinate conjunction since. And then I have an independent clause, the cat ate. It has the subject cat, the verb ate. Since the dependent clause comes first, I need a comma between them. Similarly, as the dog slept, comma, the cat ate is a dependent clause followed by an independent clause. I have the same basic structure. The as indicates that this is a subordinate conjunction, so it's a dependent clause at the beginning followed by an independent clause, so I need a comma between them. Note that you do not put a comma if you switch the order, that is, if the independent clause comes before the dependent clause. For instance, the cat ate since the dog was asleep. In this case, we have the independent clause, the cat ate, at the start of the sentence, and the dependent clause, since the dog was asleep, at the end, so no comma is needed between them. This brief lesson about comma use from the Grammar Master. Please consider subscribing so that you can see when we upload other videos, and click the like button if you felt this was helpful. Have a great day.